So I just wanted to show you guys one of the things that Modus has a habit of doing. I hope I didn't just pick up the microphone. No, okay. Yeah, this is one of the things that Modus has a habit of doing. You can see where my feet are. He tries to sit on my feet and he tries to lean on me. It admittedly has done some damage to my knees over the years because he's a very sizable lad. But it's one of the things that he does as a sign of appreciation. And apparently there are quite a lot of dogs that do that. I didn't know that until I met Modus. He has educated me in some very curious things about dogs. Hey, Mr. Bud. Yeah. I've loved a few big dogs in my life. And I do love the moats. Yeah. Now, if you're wondering where his name came from, uh, we actually adopted him with that name. So, he came from an animal rescue society with that name. And, uh, yeah, it is Latin for method. I don't know why somebody would name him that, but we decided to keep it because it was just so different. He is so sleepy, but he doesn't want to walk away from the camera. I, I gave him the chance a while ago to just go to bed. He's such a camera hog. Oh dear. <laughs> I was going to take a knee. <laughs> Can't do that. You're such a camera hog. Yes, you are. And I'm giving you all the camera attention you want. And you don't even know what to do with it. Poor bud. I know, it's because I don't have, see, there it goes again, <laughs> it's because I don't really have my own focus, and normally, you are whatever I'm into, in the background, grazing, like you were in the last few videos, <laughs> we're chasing one of the farm animals, so we get that, we do. Oh my, I smell a jobby. I hope I didn't step in one. Did you push me into a jobby? That's another one of his sports. He'll push me, he'll, he'll cause somebody to step into one of his little surprise bombs. I'm just gonna have a quick look. I don't see any near here, so. Okay. Should be fine. Hey, bud. Such a good boy. Such a handsome lad. Yeah. We're hoping to get him to the vet soon. He's got a spot on his tummy that we've been treating here at home, and it was doing all right, and suddenly it just got worse. I don't know. It's really bad turnaround for him, so we're going to try to find a new vet. Our old vet, um, I don't know, personality's changed there, and it's just not the same anymore. So, we're going to see who else is available where we're at. We'll keep you posted. 